Deep into that darkness peering, long I stood there, wondering, fearing, doubting. Understand fear as I have. Good morning, afternoon, and evening, everyone. This is Hippie Tesla, and did I remember to do the thing? Uh, yes, I did. All right, you can hear me. Like I said, good morning, afternoon, and evening, everyone. This is Hippie Tesla, and welcome to episode two of the Uliot run of the Eternal Darkness. Said it is Requiem for the GameCube. <gasps> How's everyone doing there? Mutation. Before we begin, I looked up the song from last time. I expected something from the 80s. It turned out to be a uh, Something from early 2000s, which reminded me of Disney Channel for some reason. It wasn't the tune I was expecting, but uh, very positive. It's game time. Get your Hanes on. Lace up your 90s. Crap. <laughs> Man, like, imagine if we could time travel like that. Hello, Comrade Gamut. Hello, welcome. And welcome in all the Professor Wesker Raiders. Uh... And good night, Wesky. I know I couldn't say it in 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 voice, but yeah, it's like it's with you, Thank you. in heart. <laughs> let's give let's give a good old. I don't know what to call them. Like I call them default uh, Twitch, Prof, Wesker Cho, one two three four. Default Twitch shoutouts. They have their place and value. And Wesky, damn, by God, Wesky's had so many raids. He's almost had more raids on my channel than, you know, I've had streams. I, I, go with it. <laughs> thank you, Mutation, thank you. How you doing, Gamut? How's work? Mayo, how you feeling today? And, uh... Joe. That, you know, when I saw Friday... <laughs> I'm here till Friday. I remember you were going on a vacation, so I, I thought it was happening now, but it's not actually, it's happening later. But my brain, brain jumped like, oh shit, I was planning stuff and he's not even gonna be there. Najuni. Good evening, Najuni. 
All right, I'm back. Get some coffee. If you're having coffee at work, I imagine you do. Like most people. Slot B. There's nothing in slot A. Yeah, there's not even... Why would you offer that? I guess if you if you really want to check. So we finished, what, 5 out of 13, 14 chapters? I don't know how many there are. But we finished Max's chapter. One of the saddest. And we're moving forward. I can I can never remember which order to go after this. But, you know, once I see it... It's always, it just, just, you know, it just comes back. I got, I started delaying the third coffee of the day till stream time. Because it feels good. It keeps me fresh, you know. Keeps me yapping more. Because I don't talk enough in these streams. <laughs> I can't even finish that with a straight face. <laughs> but yeah, since it's getting later, it's winter. It's more cozy. I get drowsy already around nine. So like this works good. Oh yeah, I had an update this morning. So like when you were playing, I was updating it and had to work. But yeah, I really want to see how that's going. Want to see the updates. It's kind of sad. I, I'm the one who likes seeing the levels of players. But, you know, I'm the I'm the minority. I get why people don't want to see them. And they like we talked about, they, they've, been <laughs> they've been asking for that back in Resistance even. So yeah. Man. You know, there's a game I want to stream and it'll come, like, it'll it'll get its day. Damage field, was that it? No, reveal invisible, that's what we need, yeah. That's gonna help us. Um, Mortal Kombat Deception. I want to do that story mode, it's probably... Instead of the whole Mortal Kombat marathon, as is usual with, like, the whole fucking series playthrough, I'm gonna do that, and that just reminds me, this reminds me of that, it's so fluid. Only that game on the PS2 has progressive... That game on the PS2 has progressive mode, progressive scan mode, so it looks amazing even for even on, on the capture card. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm talking about. I started playing that recently. Oh shit, the, the the picture's bleeding. That means yeah, that means her sanity is dropping, isn't it? Yep, it's halfway there. Starting to trip shit now. It's still not a hellscape, but slowly it's gonna morph in from this serene painting of a luscious mountain valley into a hellscape with uh, held nipples. We've seen that last time with Max. There's the secret door. That's for later. Put that cookie down. Seriously, guys? Are you planning? Are you two, like, planning this behind the scenes? Woo! All right. Before I do that, I guess I gotta no, there's no before, I gotta sing now. Come on. Chad and Carlos really like the game, so we have two new companions to play with. Oh right, that's I mean that's pretty good. Like how do you make another person's voice when you're already doing the voice? That's like that's some inception shit right there. <laughs> so how do I voice Joseph and myself separately with Arnold's singing voice? Who? But I'm glad to hear that. I always wondered what uh, Schwarzenegger would sound like <laughs> if he were singing. <laughs> Imagine that. <laughs> I like you, Sally. I'm going to kill you last. <laughs> uh, choking on bad ass. Well, that can be interpreted interpreted differently. Hello, mother of hippie. Hello, welcome, mom. Hi, mom. Don't mind me doing like this. Is what these are my friends. This is what they make me do. What can you do? This is the you raised a very socially adept person. Zdravo rajko moja, kako si? Ljubite sin. The queen. <laughs> you know how many children she has? She might as well be the queen. You know, her dream was to make a football football club from her kids. Which, you know, European football, soccer, 11 people in a club. Not counting the benches, bench warmers. So that's like a goalie and 10 players. That's how many she wanted. She got halfway there. El čuješ ti to rajka? Ne znam da li ona čuje, ona je gluva malo. Reci joj sale da skrene pažnju. What the, what was I doing? Oh yeah, I was singing. I was singing like I know for some reason, people like this. They like to put the cookie down. 
with the uh, what do you call with the wild care they want to put the cookie down and carry a tune instead which is very hard when you are that's not even my voice but I'm still doing it somehow yeah <laughs> Uh, I bet she's uh, swelled with pride and thank you guys that's like a wonderful thing for my mom to see instead of catching us all with drugs in our hands which is usual you know for moms to catch their kids with <laughs> while they're with friends did you guys do that in school like somebody <laughs> somebody uh, yes, call, their mom calls on the cell phone when the cell phones were still new so like our generation just got them and Immediately, everyone around will be like, put the joint down, you know, shit like that. Like, toss the beer away. Oh, his mom's calling. Get back the needles. Back the needles. <laughs> I've never had anyone actually get into trouble with that. But I'm pretty sure some parents were, you know, halfway there. You know how it is with teenagers. What the fuck am I doing? Uh, blue, red, green, blue. Green. Green get kills blue. Spell list. Reveal invisible. Come on. We have to reveal the invisible power that's stopping Arnold from becoming the master of the world. Now that did not do what did that? Oh, maybe with damage field. Because we need to kill our field with another field. Damn, that's loud. Oh shit, no wrong spell. So, I was right the first time. I'm, I'm pretty sure I was right. Is it just blue? If it's just red, green, blue. No? Ah, I'm not in the right place at all. Okay, I know. This is because this is not the spell you use there. But this. Where's that room? Here? Oh no, not that one. But this. Oh, for the love of fuck. No, wait, that's not it. You're almost there. I, this is my mansion. I know it like the back of my hand. Don't look at me, statue. Here we go. Yeah. But this is where we need to use it. So it's Uliot already, which means right spell, wrong location. There you go. All right. Time to use the dresser key. Now that we can see the fucking lock. Using the dresser key, Alex unlocks the drawer. Yeah. No, unlock it and just leave it there. Kako ti se deca zahvaljuju što si me rodila? Inside is a chrome finished revolver of, and a tattered page. Yes. A journey into darkness. Svi ti kažu hvala majko. Hvala majko hipijeva. I gotta translate and slowly say it for her. She is a senior citizen. She good thing she doesn't understand this. She just like teleport here, like woo into the screen, just carry me away. <laughs> uh, here we go. Heart will be in our possession, my liege. Never underestimate the power of Mantorok. He is wise. Even in death, Julia it erodes all about itself. It is unguarded. The presence of the corpse god causes fear in all who come near it. It has torn entire villages asunder and made the region uninhabitable. Only the foolish would venture near it. Even so, what may be easy to take may be easily taken away. Fear not. For centuries we have searched for something that was before us all the time. Mantarok's essence never left the city temple, and with it located, we are one step closer. How did you just realize that? Yes. There's yes. a gap here I never filled. You can't tell where, like, if it's his, his neck or his chin or, like, beard. I tried to explain Twitch to my boomer mom and it was beyond her compre per comprehension. I am blessed and cursed for my parents being, you know, tech savvy. When we were kids, dad knew everything about uh, VCR. We had a video VCR a recorder and a player so he could dub cassettes for us and all that. 
he knew that shit and you know that's when i got start, started in, getting interested in video technology and my mom <clears throat> Well, here's a here's a good and bad side of that. So I showed her Galaxian. Well, I was a teenager, let's say first year, first year uh, high school. <clears throat> so some 17, 18, 19, 20 years ago. <laughs> and uh, I showed her Galaxian on the on the Famiclone. We had a couple of Famiclones, and she started playing it. Well, I could say goodbye to that Famiclone. That's one thing, because I couldn't, you know, I couldn't get to the, <laughs> I couldn't get to it. But then I would just wake up and see a, a, a score posted on the fridge when I'm going to school. Her high score, you know, that is obviously better than anything me, Lyubka or Anna or the youngest one did or any of the nephews and anyone who was gaming. So we were always trying to catch up to her until maybe like six months into it. We just gave up. We couldn't do it as good as she did. And um, years later, I watched those documentaries about how we go get, grow, you know, as we, after 30 years, we slowly lose, you know, reflexes and all that, that the prime for reflex-based gaming is around 25 up to 30. But then I remember my mom, who was already over 50 back then, and she was just nailing Galaxian, which is reflex game as far as, you know, I'm concerned, as far as I see that. So... You know, there's a. <laughs> be careful what you wish for, Gammy. It might come true. <laughs> but no, seriously, I'm. I'm happy my mom got to enjoy that. You know, and she plays mostly Facebook games now, to my dismay. But yeah. Yeah, they say that, but I don't know. Maybe it's like playstyles change. Personally, for me, I think I'm I'm better at some games now because I'm more cocky. Now, in online setting, Joseph has seen me do stupid shit so many times just because I was like, what's the worst going to happen? It's a game. But when I was younger, I didn't play like that. The, I, w I was playing more, more, you know, conserved, I guess, more cons more timid. You know, you know what I'm trying to say, right? It's, you know, like way less risks. But now I do it like in these games. But then again, like I said, I do it on like, yeah, he's laughing. <laughs> and I'm like, you know what? I'm going to try this. It's probably going to kill me. And usually by the time I'm finishing that sentence, it's killing me. But that's how we learn. You know, in a game, we can have that chance. In real life, we can't. So, yeah. I feel that it's going better. Pa više pričam priče nego gora, ali da. Može i tako da se kaže majko. Are we journeying into darkness today? The ancients' influence was incredible. From all walks of life to all parts of the world, their tendrils crept and wrought their insidious damage. Their prisons decayed constantly as their guardian's work continued. I discovered mention of a brief no, he... satellite radar imaging that revealed how do I how do I explain it? Ever since I got into technology, he got out of technology. He just decided he can. He can like perfectly. I bet he could like Edwin Lindsay fucking hack shit. He just doesn't want to. He doesn't have a need and he's like I'm out of this. So no, he does I know he does watch me and sees me because he does, did ask. <laughs> he does ask things now and then, but he doesn't interact. He found these in Paul Augustine, a collector of rare items. I mean, I could probably swap him in as a as a as a. What do you call that? After a dysentery riddle to adventure. A dub. Lindsay and Augustine. You know the person that like stand, stands in for you. He's basically. A, he looks like an older version of me, which is good. That we, that way, we know he is my dad, and the mailman lied. <laughs> All right, the, the totally unsuspicious yes, this is it. priest it's guy. I hadn't expected the information to pan out, but here it is. The satellite data was correct. That's also I Colonel. Colonel Campbell. Damn. Very pleased, Comrade Lindsay. Very pleased. Very pleased. Very pleased. Very pleased. I will give you an early bonus. Ooh, Colt M 1911. Mine. No, we take the weapon. It's worth money, if nothing else. My God. 
How old are my parents this year? Mom's you are a scholar, Dr. Lindsay. Not a 73. Jesus God, God, Christ, I gotta, I gotta double check that. And dad's 69 then. Don't be a fool. Die nice die. year. And you will not suffer. The 50s. They're from the 50s. Jesus Christ. This place will be your tomb. Just as it is meant for They walked the earth before the Beatles were even a thing. I like how he walks in with the little cape. Jesus. Oh, we want to listen to... Well, after I kill him, I just got to remember to listen to uh, Uliath Autopsies. Papa Mutation still plays video games to this day. Papa Gamma is so old he barely understands what a video game is. Nice. 76 soon. Jesus Christ, your parents are older than mine. How is that a possibility? Like, mine were already pretty old, you know, compared to my, you know, schoolmates. My my parents would come in there like almost like they're my grandparents. The, the, <laughs> the difference between most other kids, you know, parents and mine. But then that's like, he's even older. Mom, there's someone older than you. How is that even possible? <laughs> Oh, okay, okay, yeah. Mom, 65, still, yeah, she's closer to my dad than, yeah. Damn. 76, that's what, 1947. Wow. Wow, indeed, man, your dad lived in a whole different realm of existence. One that I'm very fascinated by, by the way, the 50s, the 60s. Well, yeah. U.S. from 20s to 70s, very fascinated by by the culture and everything. But yeah, sheesh, that's amazing, man. That's amazing. What a warrior. What do we have? 37 shotgun shells and uh, oof, not many. We'll just go with this. Can't enchant shit yet. I don't have the book, so yeah. Oh yeah, I'm sorry. My mom is actually 23 because here's the logic that she uses. Uh, it's, um, you know, 100 years is a century. 50 years is half a century. Half is basically nothing, so it doesn't count. Therefore, by that logic, she's only 23. Drop in some math, Mike. <laughs> he was there before the first computer. Woo! He saw, like, the world change and get reborn several times. That's amazing. That's amazing. Like, glass is high. Well, I mean, do you mean philosophically or, or, uh... oh shit. Well, that was easy. Kukri, come on. That should do it. All right. We good? We good. Biologically. Well, there are little things on, the, like, tail ends, let's say, of our DNA called telomeres. <laughs> the shorter they get, the older we get. That's one of 30 different answers I could give. But that one's pretty, uh, that one's pretty popular right now. So some scientists believe by affecting the shortening of telomeres, they could affect, you know, uh, how fast we age, if we even age. But <laughs> thank you, love. <laughs> Such month. My mom says she will be turning 30 this December for the 35th year in a row. See? See? Like, our parents have it. Like, we're... We're... <laughs> we're doing it all wrong here. Like, uh, I'm, I'm 13. This, was, this wasn't my voice when I was 13. But just imagine it was. <laughs> Professor Hippie. Yes. Almost... Almost going to... Um, to draw that board that proves once again, Joseph, how Outbreak is the best game ever made. They may call me Jake Mueller by then, but don't listen to them. It's still all hippie. <laughs> I have to infiltrate Umbrella somehow, so I gotta. I can't give him my true identity. That would just be crazy, wouldn't it? So what's with the temple from this? Okay, so this chamber 
That's the first chamber from before. Bronze, right? There we go. But this one stays closed. I, I, I guess like the plant life ate it. Can't remember if there's anything else for him here, but let's pretend not. My best friend. And since we've seen so many cutscenes... Oh, shit. <laughs> Never sure if it's a... Uh, one of them... Kareem. One of them um, sanity effects. Or am I losing my mind? Or is it something happening? Maximilian Royvis. Yeah, we weren't here for the past two. That's right. They died defending it. But they also... You know what always bugged me? They also... Um, how would I explain it? All the other protagonists, including Lindsay here, they all encounter darkness in a set. What would the right word be? So just let me see. Red, green, blue. This is blue, it's green. In a set order, so it's not chronological. It's more like the way the game's presenting to us, which can, you know, which could point out that. Uh, That the book travels through time. Is this guy gonna get up? No, I gotta... F I think the blue guy is the only one gonna get up. No longer. Now we can leave the other one. He's gonna burn, baby, burn. <laughs> How is it possible? I don't know if they're poking fun at the, the video game logic or... Just like legit, but still, it made me giggle. Ooh, little fuckers can stand on these. Oh, he killed himself. Nice. Wasn't really smart to stand on that, was it? Metal bracelet. What's with it? Oh yeah, we got a cheap flawed metal. Probably junk. No, just use it. Then use it. Alright, we got tier, which means summon. We'll be able to summon creatures in no time. The fuck did I see? Ah, oh, horror. A protected horror. So, I need the magic that'll destroy his protection bronze necklace that'll open the other end right because this is closed the horror doesn't give a shit for now we need to use that necklace why is he looking up that usually means something's going screwy please don't please don't lose your head and shoulders and other parts easy does it Lindsay. easy Fuck yeah. At least they're visible. The traps. The... What do you call those? Uh, they're called... Trap tiles, I guess? Where did I see that recently? Oh yeah, Undying. That's right, we could see them with the... Not on stream though, that was in private. But yeah, I just remembered. Because I recently saw it somewhere. Floors like that. Where should I go now? I'm gonna go through the door. I think it doesn't matter because the temple temple cycles. It goes in circle. Round and round it goes. Aha. Uh -huh. Pick up this one. But put the shitty one on. What are you seeing? Dripping Venom. Ooh.
Just put a cheap one on. Indiana Jones, that shit. Oh, man, that's a really bad position to enter on. All right. Nailed it. Just easy. There's no... There's no need to hurry. Especially with uh, Mantarok zombies. They're really susceptible to fire. They're the most rotten and... Uh... There you go. And least powerful, literally. Thanks, love. Dispel. Fuck yeah. We'll be able to dispel field. Any data. Oh, jeez. Be right back, boys. Don't look at me. So, did I put this on? What's... Why? That should be it. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Here we go. Ooh, I got some... I still got some juice. I got a full glass. Mmm. Mmm, sour cherry is sour. Nobody said that on packaging. I gotta sue someone. Oh, shit. I actually needed that. Thank you. I've been sitting here all day working and then I think I had like an hour free time before the stream. Ow, 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 ow. Arm. Fuck yeah. There you go. Uh, you guys do that. I'll be right back. Think they've blown, blown by now? <laughs> Didn't think they've blown? So what did we get so far? We got area? Okay, we need summon. Oh, of course, we'll need the codex for that. Can I... How do I... Yeah, that's later. I'm gonna need protection. Oh, you can stop their humming if you leave the room. Nice. Just butcher them all. <laughs> Easy. Can you even see which one? Oh shit. What's my sanity? This one doesn't have really you know, blow me away music, so... I'm okay with going full full insanity in this level. Yeah, I don't know where's Dupka today, honestly. No! Fucking... Seriously? That's not what I wanted you to do. Dispel magic, here we go. That's what we're gonna do. Silver, okay. We don't have anything so Oh, we do have a silver bracelet, okay. Need more, huh? Easy does it. Enchanted sword goes a long way. Oops. Alright, that's good. No harm done. Alright, better be ready. I gotta enchant it again. You know what? I'm gonna enchant my shotgun. Fuck that. And then use... The spell magic is blue, so green. Oh, shit. Oh. Please fall down. Yeah, I'm a geek. <laughs> That's so cool when they fall in slow-mo. Alright, so I want some help. Sanity, we're gonna leave. How many in the barrel? One. Seven times. Yeah, I could reload. Hmm. 
Another silver thing. So that, that's what it was blocking. Just that. Here you got a step. All right. What, well, that's it? No more? You gotta dress her better, man. Nothing there. Oh, that, that's where the tablet fell from. That's why cobwebs. That's pretty cool. Let's try it this way. Enchant in 1911. Eat lead, mother buzzer. No. Did that kill him? He blew himself up. Oh shit! Weird fucker. Need one more, I think. Okay, one more after this. Sure. These guys you gotta finish, because they're. Her, his corpse is in my way moving forward, see? It's going to remove all the blue. All the blue. Why is it detonating like that? Like there's a horror somewhere. Am I missing something? Is there a horror here? I hear it. I don't see it. No, it's somewhere down there. But definitely that's a horror. Horror. Oh, yeah. Joe, my singing buddy. And my trusty companion. And the torture of my life. All right, we got it. There was a horror. Oh, that's a sanity effect. It was tripping. I was tripping balls. There wasn't really a horror. I was just the game was making me think there was one. Pretty cool game. Pretty cool. <laughs> ah. If it's not my friends, it's my games that I'm trying to make a fool out of me. Ah. I don't need your help. I'm a fool already. Where's the map? Left and right. Well, uh, let's go in towards where it seems that... Never mind. I think this is gonna... Ah! It's fucking second grade traps. Gotta do everything myself. Am I really sure I want to go that way? Oh. No, 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 no. He's... Fuck. Why do they always do that there? Elia did the same in the last episode. When the sanity is down, they walk into the fucking traps. That's horrible. <laughs> That's really bad. Oh shit. Oh, be right back. That is... Oh god. Always, I always think my game's broken when this happens. <laughs> oh boy. Well, since it's a red one, red, green, blue. I need a blue enchantment. Let's do it on a shotgun again. Why not? Fuck yeah. Don't let him spark you.
not gonna finish him because of aforementioned reasons. Love those reload animations. You know what they remind me of? <laughs> you hold the button to reload. The controls are pretty much the same as in the game. Joseph doesn't want me to hear. What well, doesn't want to hear me mentioning? Dirt encrusted. Dirt encrusted. That sounds so heavy. Oh wait, I can. I can dispel this red. Green, blue, so blue again. The spell. That's one of them, okay. Ah, the secret room, that's right, that's in this level. Need to find three of these. Shit. Is this the gas one? No, it's not. Fuck, gotta be quick. Never mind, it did it for me. I think it's gonna be okay if I slowly go there. Yeah, you can actually sneak in this game. But here, there's nothing we can do. We gotta step on this one. It's the gas. Oh shit. Alright, I gotta get to the other side. Oh shit. These are... These look like Mantorog zombies. Unless they're... Zelotad, which would be pretty bad. Yeah, they're Zelotad zombies. Oh no, they also burn. Burn, baby, burn. I do need just a sliver of my sanity back. Thank you very much. Well, that's too little of a sliver, but... How about you, sir? Where's the other one? Would you give me a sliver of my sanity back? Oh, no. How about here? He actually did it. Little heal. Red, green, blue. Red, green, blue. So, blue. Blue... No, wait. Red, green, red. I love the loading speed of the GameCube still. It's a disc-based system, but it loads so fast. So in that, like, less than a second, it loaded another room. And I can hear the laser hard at work. But it just, you know, goes to show. I think it loads... On, on average, it loads even faster than the OG Xbox, which loads pretty fast thanks to the hard drive caching it has. Something that the PS2 and, uh, and the GameCube couldn't say, you know. Where is it? Here? If I'm tripping balls, I should be able to trip more balls. More balls, please. Gold. Okay, so we gotta clean the gold ones. We gotta find an acid font somewhere. Don't fall on the thing. Oh shit. Oh shit, that, that hurt just a little. It's sh Not as much as you'd think, considering... Ah, oh, you little dick. Not, not really good. What's in here? Just more mentor of zombies. Have I got a medicine for you, sir? What, just one? What are we, out of guards? So this time it's Ulioth. Which means... Green now, for real. Red, green, blue, yeah.
Ага. Does that activate or deactivate the gas back there? Oh yeah, the acid pool. There we go. That's what I was looking for. The way it's just written, this water smells like a strong acid. <laughs> Ta da Is this where I came from? No. This is not where I left my car. Oh shit, something's gonna come out of there, I remember. But what? Where is that one? No, that's where I just was. Gold. Need one more, okay. The, yeah, I just came from here, so let's try the other entrance. Yadi, 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 yadi. The way they're stuck, 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 stuck. Oh no, I'm sinking. I'm sinking. I'm in the floor. This can't be happening. Of course it can be, man. Nobody can walk inside the floor. You're not made by Bethesda. Okay, easy does it now, explorer boy. Oh shit, oh, you gotta step on one of them, huh? Which one will it be? Poison darts. I'll take the poison darts. Can we summon yet? No, I need the... I still need the rune. It's gonna be somewhere in cobwebs, I assume. Aha! Okay, I need this one more thing, right? So I need the guy to turn towards me. The way he turns. So whenever he's not looking, it's... It's released. Now you can close it. I wasn't there. Ha, ah, I'm behind him. Oh, I'm coming behind him and he did not hear me come shit no wait not that I mean this that confused me like what do you mean you can't use my my brand new torch shit 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 they really didn't mass produce these trap tiles they could have, but they didn't. So what is this? This goes up, down, this... Oh! Into that darkness. This <laughs> really uh. So what's the shortest route to there? It just doesn't matter. Wherever I go, I'm fucked. I guess this way I can at least see what's in front of me. Charge! Oh, minimal damage, maximum damage. Maybe a little heal. But just health, we're not healing sanity. Healing sanity is for girly men only. We are only manly men here. Woo! So the traps have are still active from the last time. Gas. Gas, gas, gas. Poison darts. Gas, gas, gas. Poison darts. Well, you know, I can't guarantee they're poisoned, but... Why wouldn't they be? Like, why build an elaborate trap and not poison your darts? It's just... Rude. People expect poison darts. Yeah, gold. Gold! They all have just... You can clearly see they, they had... They could have had more. Maybe it's just something else they're wearing. It looks like they could have had more... Uh, 
jewelry on them. Remember me, Alex. How can I forget you, Grandpa? You've always meant the most to me. Ever since... Ever since my parents died. Yes. Ever since they were killed. You've been my little girl. Creepy. He's trying to tire her. This can't be happening. Mentally and emotionally trying to break her. Oh, can't save. The darkness is coming. Really? Why? What's stopping me? <laughs> hey, Delmar. Delmar, how you doing, man? I don't know. I've never seen young Britney Spears. I'm too old for that shit. So I, I wouldn't know, really. Yeah, that <laughs> that's just what she looks like. I always compare her to uh, Joanna Dark for some reason. Maybe because she's in a game that has something to do with darkness. Who knows? I'm great, man. I love playing this game and it's been a year, so I'm enjoying it. Is that a horror? Oh my god, it's a green horror. Ah! Red, green, blue, red. We need red. Right, red. Shotgun. Going shotgun on it. And immediately run! Ooh, nice dodge. Oh, she, he's going again. Yeah, yeah, I wanted to see the... Oh, shit. Autopsy parts. Oh, there goes my sanity. In the face, motherfucker. Shall I kill it for a little sanity? I mean, think that would be okay. I I'm gonna finish it and get some sanity. Just so I'm not to the middle. Oh my god, that's too much, dude. Can I can you take some back? I don't want to be too normal. She had to go through the trials and tribulations of hell first. Oh, this is her hell, huh? Oh, I'm still crazy. I can still hear crazy noises, so that's good. I want to be crazy. Here, we can finally save. Damn, it wouldn't let me save there. Avar. So I need that summon rune. Oh, this is where Elia was. This is where she fell in, right? Like a hundred years ago. Yep, this is the same corridor. She fell, only she fell in somewhere in here. There was another door. Easy does it. Easy, easy boy. Oh shit, just that, not bad. That's not bad, it could have been a lot worse. Oh my god, look. What is... I'm on a ceiling. <laughs> I'm losing my mind here. How do I even get out from the ceiling? Where did I come in? Where did I come from? Let me out, game. Should be somewhere here. Can I get out? Or am I stuck like this forever? Oh, shit. Okay, fair enough. I wanted more sanity effects. I got more sanity effects. I guess you're wrong. Britney's big single "Hit Me, Baby" released in 1999. <laughs> now, when Britney looks back on her life, she reflects and thinks, "If I survived eternal darkness, I can survive anything." Mm, yeah. <laughs> was it? I think it was like "Seed of Chucky." When he uh, pushes her off the cliff. Ow. And uh, and then <laughs>, laughs like Chucky does. Oops, I did it again. Ah, but I can't do like Brad Dourif crazy laugh is just Brad Dourif. Oh, there's some cobwebs here. Only Brad Dourif can do a Brad Dourif crazy laughter. <laughs> Air attack.
Oh yeah, there's more of this. I need the torch though. No, first press. Arrival of strange light. Okay. And you can see him. That's Mantarok. The ancient Khmer are just praising it. And it literally arrives from space via a time portal. Or maybe not time, just portal. Where did I come from? Where did I go? I'm going left. So let's see this way. A little heal. Let's not forget. Alright, I'm sure I'm gonna find a rune soon. And I'll have to backtrack all the way up there. Shit, stop that. Always where there are tra these traps. Trap tiles. They're gonna swing on their own. But you know, I did ask for it. I could get my sanity up. But no, I want to see more sanity effects. Oh, well, there you go, your sanity effects. Oh shit, uh, Chaturga, red, green, blue, red, green, blue, uh, for me and you, be right back boy, uh, red, green, blue, so blue, enchant, blue, what am I gonna enchant, I'm gonna kill it with a pistol, in the face, In the chest, I guess. Jesus, their health is just... Almost annoying. He fell right on that. Alright, finish him. Finish him like a dog with the pistol. Oh. GG. You had to activate that shit, didn't you? Didn't ya? Shit! Good thing I had a blue pistol on me. Oops. Just headshots. Oh, it goes through them. That's pretty nice. Can I do double headshot? Yeah, it's got piercing headshots. Nice. Ooh, quick, gotta reload. Fuck yeah! Oh shit, one of them's back. You gotta finish these guys. They're they. No, no, finish him. Don't read. Are you fucking kidding me, man? You're killing me, Lindsay. Mostly, you're killing yourself. But we'll talk about that. Better do a little Kukri enchantment. Charge! Oh, beheading. Yeah, you, you know what? Nothing beats the good old melee. Beheading your enemy zombies always wins. You guys, just don't stand up, alright? I'm doing something important here. I'm trying to keep my sanity low. Ancient Khmer people coexisting with some kind of fertility god. They offer sacrifice to the beast and in return are showered with benevolence, good crops and hunting. That's the temple I'm in right now. I guess those are the tentacles of Mantarok. Those are the naked ass people of Khmer. Because it was like normal back then depicting naked people. That's what they look like. I mean for the game they couldn't go all the way up. Uh, obviously they covered their privates but not all of them. Not all the... not. Only the privatest of privates. Beautiful, just beautiful. You down there, just stay down. So still left. I'm going opposite. Maybe add some HP. Yeah, good call. Good call. Is there more cobwebs somewhere? Oh, this is where Elia fell in, actually. This is it. This is where she fell in. That's the hallway. That's right. And we couldn't go back. 
So this other part didn't exist. This was walled off right here, I think. Amazing. I love how the how the maps connect in this game. Chichurga. Yeah, it sounds like he's saying Chichurga. Alright, the crusher, I can take that. I'm the crusher. King of the ring. Oh, wow. Very funny game, very funny. <laughs> They're doing the conga train. Yeah, you know what? Oh shit, it won't let you save once you have a sanity effect. Burn them all. Yes, the rune I need. I'm pretty sure it's the rune I need. Just just guessing here. I will want to kill the... Didn't I see a... No, I'm crazy. I, I was sure I saw a Chaturga zombie there. I'm sorry, Chaturga. Some sanity, please. Thank you very much. Oh, that one didn't come. They're all dead. Oh, well. Can't always be totally sane. So now I should have all the runes. To make myself a summon spell. New spell. Let's let's do with Chichurga. Summon. Creature. Fuck yeah. Alright, now we're gonna go back up there and summon some trappers. Nothing else here. Don't run too fast. Too fast. You know the the slanted camera angle really works well in this level when your uh, when your sanity is low. I like the aesthetics. Slowly, slowly, slowly. There you go. What the hell is shotgun shells? <laughs> it's not real. He's smart enough to know that 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 much free ammo cannot be real. Uh huh. There we go. One for Gammy as well. Easy now. Easy. Very easy. Yeah. Tippy toes. Just your tippy toes. I gotta go all the way a floor back up. That's what I meant. Mean from chapter six onward, these levels, the, these chapters get progressively longer, especially the final few. They're still not, you know, they're still like mini episodes, almost, almost like scenarios, someone would say, but uh, they are longer than the first five, first four, particular. Am I good? Am I getting smaller? No? Alright. Stop that. Wow, he's always doing it around, you saw that, it's like the third time only in this stream he wanted to do that on the, while going over these traps. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Well, it'll well, be okay. I, apparently my bones are strong enough to take this shit. It's one of the attacks he takes like a pro. Wait, what's his... He's got... He's got excellent stats. I will say he's got some of the best stats in the game. Fairly good HP. Fairly good uh, sanity and... Uh, less magical power, but who needs that? We're not girly men here. We do not use magical power. Except when we do. In that case, just nobody saw anything. That's private FBI stuff. Zoop. So 
So now, if I'm not mistaken, and I probably am not, I need to go to the opposite side, yeah, where it's... Is it opposite side? Just try to go left down the hallway, right? Let's do that. With me and my minimum sanity are going down the hallway. This is going to be interesting. Yeah, I think it's this hallway. If it isn't, we're at least halfway there. Yep, it is here. Okay. I don't know what kind of horror it's going to be. I'm going to guess blue. But you know what? I'm going to be smart and do enchant red, green, green shotgun. And then summon. Oh, I can do more. All right. Green, right? I didn't want to do that. I wanted another color, but that, never mind. I don't want to waste any more mana. Let's say... Um, summon... Uliot? Uh, Zelta? Oh, let's not forget... I keep forgetting the autopsies. So, R... Yeah, okay. For a small dog. I'm a small dog kind of creature. Can't teleport these bastards. They're made like that. You gotta go here and step on this. Activates the rune. And I think that's gonna make him burst on the other side. There you go. Yeah, the moment I take it, something's gonna burst on, burst on the other side. Do I kill him? I can't trap them, they're too far away, so... You just let it... The way they die, and the little leg twitch. Alright, get ready. Yep, I called it. Down, whore, or now this is gonna make things a lot easier. Is that where I came from? So, if that's where it went, wait, I can go in there. I'm pretty sure, yeah, there's something, there's a codex behind the that's right, I almost forgot. Well, I don't have to finish him, really. Nothing's gonna happen if I don't, I'm pretty sure. Minimum sanity rush. I mean, run. Rush? Brush, rush. Mm. That means we got... Yeah, okay, I remember this nice. The Manta Rock Ruined. Good one, okay. As long as I didn't miss that, should be good. So once I'm out of there, I want to go... Shit, I forgot which one it was. If I went... Oh wait, I know how. Go lower. So I came from there. That's up, this is down. Okay, so it is the eastern one. It is the eastern one. Okay, okay, so just go left of that door or like left of that doorway that we just broke through that's right step on this better choice tells says a lot when crush crushers are better choice than all the other traps says a lot about what i guess the traps themselves Ooh, easy i think if people are speed running this game this this temple, what appears in what two? 
time periods is the one that slows it down the most because you got to take you got to tiptoe around yadi 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 ya 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 <laughs> he's already tired his stamina isn't he really couldn't brag about brag with his stamina but you know he's tr going to try Very slowly, if I go, I should be able to not to trigger any of them. Chip. Obviously, they didn't work. But if it worked, it wouldn't be like this. <laughs> that burning head really looks weird. Let's do all the burning heads. Hey, let's see how much this will restore. We go recover, but with Mantarok. Oh, that's a lot of sanity. Yeah, yeah, it is a GameCube exclusive. Well, I have a, I have the box somewhere there. I probably, yeah, I packed it up yesterday, but yeah. It is a GameCube exclusive. It was developed by Silicon Knights, the same... Uh, company that started the Legacy of Kane franchise and uh, co-developed co with Nintendo it shares some of the well it shares quite a lot with the Metal Gear Solid remake for the GameCube Twin Snakes even uh, the voice actors David Hayter and I'm ashamed to say I can't remember the name of uh, Colonel Fucking, why is Colonel Grant in my head? <laughs> Colonel Campbell's voice actor, but they, 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 they do some voices as well as uh, they provide some voices as well as the Legacy of Kane voice actors. So it's uh, quite a mi mixed bag. This is actually, let's say, my second favorite horror game, survival horror game of all time. It's hard to beat Silent Hill 2, but it's right there, man. So what do we have? Yeah. It takes place across 2,000 years with uh, 9, 10, 11 different characters. So the girl you saw before, she's in the present reading the book after her father's uh, grandfather's murder. She's trying to find out what happened, so she reads from this tome of eternal darkness. And every story she reads, you play with the character she reads about. So we go left and then left again, yeah. Easy, easy. It's one of the least graphically impressive, oh shit, GameCube games in the library, in the console's library. Mainly because its development started on for the N64, which kind of shows. But nevertheless, it's one of the most fun to play. Alright, we got this far, didn't we? Heals. Ah, yeah. Can't save, darkness is coming, huh? PlayStation and PC are the... Still were since the 90s and are still the dominant systems in my country as well, man. I was just saying yesterday how... I don't know many people who have an Xbox. Actually, I don't know pretty much anyone but myself. Here, that owns an Xbox. Blue. Wait, I'll be right back. Red. Green. Alright. I did say be right back, so let's not dilly dally. Easier to kill them when you enchanted with uh, their opposing enchantment. And go for the heads, and then an arm or two. It plays pretty much like Resident Evil, Delmar. Uh. Mostly like RE1 Remake or or those Outbreak games I play. Oh, that guy's headless still. Let's not keep him waiting. Alright, that's all the sanity I want. Yeah, it was never like that here. It was like since the 90s it was the... Oh, did I get the, the spell I just made? 
Yeah, Summon Trapper. It was... I, I remember in the Super Nintendo... During the Super Nintendo... Like the 16-bit the, the 16 16 era, that's what... Generation 4. During the 4th generation, it was... I can't have a feeling Mega Drive or Genesis led over Super Nintendo, at least in masses. A lot of people had Super Nintendo, or even in the 8-bit era, you know. 8-bit era was mostly like personal computers here, you know, like Amstrad, uh, Commodore 64, uh, ZX Spectrum, the three most the three most popular ones. So we kind of skipped the NES and the Master System. Though I hear Master System, some people have had it. But then, you know, when this generation, when 16-bit generation, 4th generation came along, a lot of people uh, were into Mega Drive, not so many into Super Nintendo, but then PlayStation cemented it. Having a GameCube or a... Am I upside down? No. Having a GameCube or a... Ooh, it's the Mantorog. It's Mantorog's grave. Look, he's kind of... He's filling. So we were here like a thousand years ago, give or take. Like say six hundred years ago, and uh, well, eight hundred almost doesn't matter. It was uh, with a different character, and this was still like a maintained grave. He still had servants around, or you know whatever they're called, people who are tending to it. But now he's just alone here. How come P Pius couldn't find the grave when he was here before? Is not this is the first character we played with from ancient Persia. He got corrupted and is serving another worldly deity. Oh, she's gonna blow him. Yeah. That's Elia. That's the girl we played with 600 years ago. 800. That. I don't know about that, dude. You look pretty beat to me. Mantorok's helping you along with Elia's soul. I think that's what's happening. Corpse God Mantorok defies all human description, maximum warfare, perhaps. But these words only capture the gross nature of the beast, not the specifics. Its form, seemingly without design or true function, stirs his linden ears, awakened by his presence. With every breath, the creature's many mouths sigh and cough, sputtering in its torturous, tortoise death throes. Jeez, that's a lot of description. So this is the third playthrough of the game I'm doing, uh, Delmar. There are three deities. Oh shit! He's very reasonable about it. There are three deities fighting over dominance of the earth and you got to do three playthroughs with, you know, with different choice at the very beginning, who this guy that just ran away, the skeleton guy, is going to side with. And I'm doing the third one, you need all three to get the true ending, so that's what I'm doing here. The game is very popular for its sanity effects, which is that little green bar is sanity. I'm keeping it low because when it's low, shit like that just now with the volume happens. The game will pretend to delete your save files, to reset your console, to turn off your TV. Yeah, I'm coming behind like, them. Look at this. All sorts of I shit. So and fast, his head fell off. Hi, Lupka. Hello, Sister Lupka. Welcome. How are you? How are people in the house? I was just telling D Delmar about the Eternal Darkness. So yeah, Delmar, if you're interested, like the first two runs from last year are on YouTube. Everything's sorted on my YouTube, like yeah, as as is usual. So uh, I did more of a story run in the first playthrough. You know, no reason to repeat everything every time, read all the text and all that. Do not touch the heart, flesh and bone. I'm glad you were, Lyubka. Like yeah, we played with her at the second chapter of the game. What do you mean hiding? You're just laying there. But I was forced to find refuge here. You must seal the heart so it never contacts your flesh 
and take it to the Gathering of Light. Take the heart there, or the world shall fall under a reign of eternal darkness. It's a tale of 2,000 years of struggle of humanity. Of reality can only be pulled back so far. Ugh. Take your stand and fight the darkness. She's been waiting there for so long. That's... Ugh. There's Mantorok's heart. He brought it to her grandpa. They did, yeah. Thanks, Gramps. Keep it for me. And now we know where it's gonna be, because we read in the book where Grandpa hid it, so we can go there and actually get it. Behind the book called The Demon and the Khmer by Edwin H. Lindsay. That's the guy we just played as, the archaeologist. Indiana Jones guy. Ah. Woo, it's getting a little chilly. Temperature's dropping. The stars are aligning. Maybe that's why I'm cold. Eternal darkness is coming. Oh shit, I totally missed that. We had a follower. Crypt Hazard. Well, if you're still around, Crypt Crypty Hazard. Cryptid Hazard. Thanks for following. That came in with... With Wesky's uh, raid, I think. Thank you there. It's Britney Spears. Yeah, it's her story. She's that guy who just hit the heart. That was her grandpa. So uh, we're trying to find out why he died. And I'm keeping her sanity low. So interestingly, as she's reading the book, she's losing sanity there. You can see it. Now, I could restore it. I have spells for it by now. Because whatever she reads from the Tome of Eternal Darkness, she learns and she can use all of them. But I want to keep it low so we see, maybe we see some shit I've never seen. There's so many sanity effects. You can never see them all uh, in one sitting, in one playthrough. Oh, Jesus Christ, the books. There's the book. It's one of the items we need. Okay, okay. Oh, thank you, love. Hear that? What's that sound? It's like ghosts walking. I did not. So I did say I want to see the I want to see the the latest uh, autopsies. That's right, that's right. So we can see the first chapter. That's like ancient Persia. We can't see I the years. Say yeah. Was the true beginning, nor am I. Autopsy. So oh, you can see all three alignments. Nice. So it was. Uliad zombie rotted from within, worried apart by the ravening fish and parasitic feeder of their sunken graves. These drowned zombies emerged, spilling their festering entrails and slopping fluids with each pain ridden step, each step hoping to bring an end to their pain by spreading it to others. What the hell is going on? May the Brit Britney Spears and where the fuck? Oh, cry the river? Is that a I don't know anything about Justin Timberlake or Britney Spears, guys. You're barking up the wrong tea. But Sasha here, she loves him. She listens to them all the time. It's probably the last stream I'll ever make. It was nice knowing you people. <laughs> uh, keep even turned the stream off for a minute. I did? Oh, really? Cry me a river. That sounds like taunting almost. Cry me a river, bitch. I don't know how it would go with Justin Timberlake. Probably something very, very... I don't know. Something that teenage girls would go crazy for, I imagine. Because it's Justin Timberlake. 
Delmar, yeah, it does have a lot. Well, Resident Evil was a big influence on this game, apparently. Well, obviously not apparently. Severing the head will prevent it from singing. I did talk about it. They can explode. Accumulation of the of gas in the abdomen resulting from decomposition is a serious threat. Watch out for explosions. So we just don't let it sing. He does that guttural singing like, what was it, Johnny English? <laughs> and uh, yeah, Uliot zombies can do that. Uliot bone thief. Those creatures inhabit the bodies of men and women, exorcising the human soul and replacing it with their own putrid spirits. But they couldn't fool me. Seriously? No, not at all. I could smell them, you see. They were all around me. Dear God, all around. I knew what I had to do. They had to go. My blade and bullet. I had to get rid of them. <laughs> Don't you understand? Dear God. God, it's I horrible. Had to do it. Had to. You believe me, don't you? Man, it's hitting me right here. Like, like I said, Max's ending of Max's chapter is the saddest for me. Not even Kareem. Kareem's is sad, but Max's is just fucking devastating. He tries to warn humanity and ends up in an asylum. And you can see in different uh, autopsy reports, he sounds like they were, like what he's saying was during the uh, interrogation in the asylum. It was the 1800s. I guess they were just like asking a few questions. He said something like this. They were like, whoop, whoop. That was a weird cuckoo. But yeah, and they just packed. It was an 1800s cuckoo. That's how they cuckooed back then. And they just put him in the asylum, which is just, I haven't done the full three game uh, playthrough in a long time so i'm remembering some of this now can't believe it was a song about britney spears were they weren't they wait wasn't he britney spears's boyfriend or something or did they mix him up with another boy band icon they have no eyes but they can see i tell you no eyes no no eyes yeah okay but you can feel it so it is a taunting song huh it's stares through you like looking through empty air and you can feel it breaking your innards with their touch a shiver of their senses combing your bowels through empty space oh horribleness so i did mention a couple of times that uh, mac maximilian's voice actor in the game during the scenario is uh, Michael Bell, who we love very much for voicing Raziel in the Legacy of Cain series. But usually when you look up voice actors, they'll mention another person. I think this is what the other voice actor did. I think what happened was they recorded all Michael Bell's lines. They were like, that's it. Maybe they forgot. Maybe it was like a logist logistical issue. But uh, when they needed him for these, he was already busy probably with Soul Reaver 2 or even Defiance. I, I assume Soul Reaver 2. So they hired someone else to do these parts. Or maybe that's him. I just don't recognize his voice. Who knows? Deep in those ancient caverns, a great city was lost. Long before we humans. Long, long the proud city of Engar, decadent and trusting, and it was their downfall. When the darkness came, and the guardians slaughtered them, their existence was... Oh, there was someone there before. ...echo shrieking from violated mouths, resounding within their homes, their tombs. If you stand alone in one of those halls, Wow, okay, yeah, I don't remember this one, definitely, I think, 
I did Dulio at last. The first time I played this as well. No obvious vulnerability. This creature bears no relation to anything in my experience. <laughs> that's what that's what the guardians are. Man, that was bone chilling. All right, uh, let's continue. P pretend none of that happened. What are you looking at, Alex? She's losing her mind. She's looking at. She's seeing invisible stuff. The picture is bleeding more and more. So the lower the sanity, the more things will change. You know, like I said, the the. The painting will definitely change. She's muttering to herself. She sees something there as well. All right. So this is blue. We need red, green. We need green. Green dispel. So that's Zelatat on Uliot. Ugh, the page is left there. The, as the magical window fades away, the piece of parchment that the maiden was holding is left behind, floating in midair. Appears to be a chapter page. Heresy! I love this chapter. Well, I love them all, but this one is extremely depressing. If you know the name of the rose, I think it's called in English as well, yeah, then this will be very familiar. Is that a nine point summon? That we can never do that in the game, what he just did. I am not your food today. I am your master. Your task is to guard the artifact before you. Let no one touch it. That's an ugly motherfucker. So that's it. That's what was happening. So that was happening back then. I'm having a flashback from when the page was written, not when it's being read. In Europe, during the time of the Inquisition, paranoia and corruption ran deep. With the fear of devilry running rampant, the ancients' corruption extended far beyond mortal knowledge, corrupting all that could be corrupted. My researches uncovered an interesting incident. A Franciscan monk named Paul Luther was traveling through the region of Amiens during the witch hunts of the Inquisition. Now, under martial law, the Inquisition prevented anyone from leaving the town and its nearby cathedral. For everyone was suspect. You you want that added to quotes, Lyubka? <laughs> Welcome to Ublier Cathedral, Brother Luther. I'm glad that our sacred order can bestow hospitality on our Franciscan brethren. I shall not impose, Excellency. I merely request lodging and a viewing of the sacred relic, the Hand of Jude. Many have traveled far and even risked their lives for a glimpse of the hallowed relic's true splendor. I only hear Mobius course, now. It would be wise that is quiet during your stay. Richard Doyle, right? The Mobius. Here for a reason, brother. We seek to purge the deviancy from this town. It's almost like he's I am hitting sure onto him. <laughs> Amiens appears to be a peaceful hamlet. It appears to be, but deviancy is secreted in the most deceptive places, which I believe is the case with Amiens. Then I wish you luck in your search. The Inquisition does not need luck, Brother Luther. Faith and purity are our guides. Now walk this way. So weird the way he walks away. All right, let's uh, let's grant Lupka's wish. Before I continue, I learn to save often because I did make a mistake last time. So that would be quotes. I take this as a template. Add a new one. 
replace the text with whatever I just said. I love this chapter. It's so depressing. I imagine I said it with the voice of the, you know, the, the funny ad. The sound quality is amazing. Me and my hammer are coming all over these stairs. <laughs> Eternal darkness. I forgot about that. Eternal darkness. <laughs> Sanity's requiem. Ninth, uh, eleventh, twenty twenty three. I'm guessing it's the European uh, date format. Yeah, yeah, ninth November. There you go, Lubka. Slight edit. There you go. It's been added. <laughs> so it should be quote... Was it 8? No, quote 7. Oh, no, wait. Quote space 8, right? No? Wait, what? Quote 9. I was just looking at it, but I forgot which one was it. Yeah, there you go. Nine. Ah, but it didn't quote it for you. I guess because we both triggered it at the same time. <laughs> there you go, Luka. The door is locked. Should I follow the guy up there? I forgot which order do I want to take this in. Do I want to go to the bell tower first? Oh my god, I love this cathedral. Look how beautiful it is. They really showed the, you know, the, the architectural style and the council could take it, literally. It wouldn't look this nice on the PS2, I, I'm, I guarantee it. Even if they held the resolution, it would still have issues running at 60, you know. I'm, I'm grateful it's one of those games that has the option of running at 60 hertz in, in Europe. Not many did, really. There's no one there. Alright. So I went the wrong way, huh? Huh? Ah. The lighting, the everything, just fucking amazing. But that's also the thing, because they started uh, making it for the N64, which was already... It was more powerful than many consumer PCs when it came out, and by the end of its lifespan, it was still more powerful than, you know, a PC most normal people would be able to uh, afford. Unlike those abnormal people who could afford, you know, better computers. Do I want to go there? I don't think... Yeah, I shouldn't have gone there. For the love of God! God! Help! Come quickly! The way he approaches there, so ominous. All hunched. A murder most foul. What heresy is this? He was like this when I found him. <laughs> I found him lying here, dead. I called the guards. Ah, is this our first suspect? Make sure no one touches the body. It must be examined for signs of devilry. Did you see her face, man? Man, make sure man. he doesn't leave the cathedral. We will question him later. But hold your tongue. We're not gonna put you in the dungeon. Just not gonna let you leave. You trust in the Almighty, and you are indeed innocent, that you will have nothing to fear. Well, except you, man. Like, just are you are you seeing yourself? Look how you're walking. Nobody walks like that. It's just very unnerving about his walk. Emerald. Are you here, 
here to pass sentence on me? No. I'm here to free you. After you stole our jewel. You are in incredible danger. This cathedral used to be a place of peace. No, it would never. So many strange we fucking killed... Here. What was this guy? Charlemagne. Like the others. What do you mean? The body you found was Brother Andrew. And he was killed to protect his secret. Uh, we can't talk me, about it here. Uh, find me in the bell tower later. Find me in the and bell tower. Why are you releasing me? This is like, I, I only see it as opera now. Innocent die like your Franciscan brethren. I have seen Brother Andrew make numerous entries into his journal. Yeah, we need the journal. This may contain the answers to the cathedral's dark secrets. What can I do? If I were you, I'd run. They will surely hunt me if I run. Then don't run. This has to stop. Then be it on your own head, Luther. Find Brother Andrew's journals if you can. He spent time in the old tower investigating. I believe I can find the key to the old tower in one of my stores. Later, come find my stores. The bell tower. All right, so just go to the bell tower. Be swift. We can't evade them forever. Oh, I'm I'm about to go into the hole of the tomb, right? So it's like church stuff basically, huh? Let's go. That's a very nice effect. Who's next? We've seen him. Kareem. Who's... Oh yeah, Lindsay didn't die. That's right. But Paul here will die for the tome. He's gonna get one of those empty spots. Amazing game. You are truly amazing. Up, up, up and away. Let's go get the torch first. I think that's gonna help me big time. So I could, what I figured out last time, I could have avoided getting a trapped until I get the torch if I went on the side but there's no need like not much changes you can still go what does this do sanity yeah he he's got good sanity excellent ma magic and horrible <laughs> horrible health that's like really bad health gonna need some weaponry yeah why wouldn't you open yeah we get the fucking crossbow it's a motherfucking crossbow. Beautiful. Artistically beautiful. Podium key. He said he had the key to the old tower as well, right? So I should go visit him and see that. You notice how each location has its own chime, Lyubka? So the, like the cathedral has its own for Anthony, Paul here, and uh, later... Uh, Raziel, what's his name in the game? Um, that guy. I forgot what his name was. The Peter Jacob, that's right. There we go, diary page. Do we need to read it? Yada, yada, yada. There are monsters here. The monsters are coming back to town. Signed, Brother Andrew. Did he call himself Brother? Ooh. Okay, so we gotta find the we gotta find the music sheet for that. Well, let's not forget about Najuni. Man, I'm trying to space these, but also remember everyone. It's a good exercise for my brain, and good support for my friends who are here every fucking stream. There you go. There. Check out all the people we mentioned tonight. 
but not pious. That guy's an asshole. Don't check him out. Wait, is there something there? Oh, there's the corpse, right? That's why he's looking. Is the corpse still there? Just like hanging on the... Oh, he's tired. Look at him. All right, let's rest him a little. Ah, he's holding his sides. Isn't that lovely? All right, run with all your priestly might. I don't have much stamina being a priest. Or no, what is he? He's not a priest. He's a monk. It's not the same. He's looking at the murals. It's a Mantorok zombie. How did it get there? And why would Mantorok send zombies for the protectors of the tome? It makes no sense. Unless it's like a test. If you can kill one of Mantorok zombies, you're worthy of being the protector of the tome? Where is he? What if we just gave the sign that Pope died? <laughs> he was what? Waiting around the corner for me to ring the bell? Not awkward at all, my guy. Ah, oh, Brother Luther, not a moment too soon. As you have noticed, dread things inhabit this place. Shambling corpses and worse. Is worse, like that priest you got here, in the midst of the Inquisition. Oh, this is Paul Luther. That, but I have no proof. Brother Andrew knew this Colonel Campbell from Metal Gear. That's the voice he gives priest. as well. Why are you telling me this? Perhaps you can finish off what Andrew started. Take this key. It unlocks the old tower. It has been sealed off since the Inquisition. Arrived. Paul Eding, that's right. I Paul Eding, to God. Uncover the truth behind this. If you manage to uncover the source of darkness, return here, and I will do everything I can to help. Till then, brother, may your faith protect you. How about a weapon? Can a weapon protect me? No. All right. Not much help, you guy. But okay. I love how he goes, Paul Eden goes from Colonel Campbell, you know, if you played Metal Gear Solid, especially MGS2, you know what I mean, but uh, goes from that to being a monk, a timid monk, no less. His voice is kind of, it, it still, it still works, it doesn't mismatch, you know. Among other roles he's had over the years, of course. Let's go to the old tower. Let's go to the old tower. Wait, can I go down yet? Kind of feel like I should. Yeah, let's check down. Definitely there's gonna be shit here like this. And another letter. Book, book of reliquaries. Reliquaries or reliquaries? Late 13th century. Yeah, it tells us that the hand of Jude might be a false um, relic. Come on. Weird ass picture. The only man that doesn't need a bed is a dead one. Well, yeah, freelancers as well, since we work like 15 hours a day. <laughs> ah, there it is. That's what I want. The cudgel. The steel mace. That's my weapon of choice here. And he's good with spells, so, you know, it's gonna work in my favor. At least I hope. Some volume. 
He was so close. Is there more? Or is two enough? Two is enough, okay? One of these is false. It's the one where there's no wine, right? There we go. Man, that chime is almost ruining it. Yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say, it's all like creepy and cool, and then they go like, ah. Be right back. So it was a red horror. Red. Red, red, red. Red, green, blue. Mm, red, green, blue. Okay. Enchant. I'm gonna say, well, let's enchant both. Yeah, let's enchant that as well. Shoot him in the face and then go for more. Oh shit, that's quite a reach, boy. Better keep distance with him. Why isn't it working? I'm, oh my god, you need to do the full animation. You need to do the full reloading animation, otherwise it doesn't count. Better be able to see him. Will you die? Come on. Shit. I think I missed a few times, but or like hit the wall or something, but he's down. Reload. Takes a really long time to reload this thing. So we got the sapphire, we got the ruby. Aha. Uh -huh. It looks like the same uh, pad where Anthony put the 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 bowls of water if you remember. All right, all that's left is the old tower. Yeah, the set, as sanity goes down, weirder and weirder noises are added to the music until, you know, you just start hearing weird and nothing else. We see bone thieves in action. face in the face already down with sanity i'm gonna leave it like this i want him to trip the balls and you know the camera angle is more interesting this way anyway shield protect self of course so let's let's assign it Specifically, yeah, specifically health shield, we're going to put it to 
let's say down putting our feet to the ground there you go shield we got recovery we got shield it's gonna be very helpful with him with his low HP I do want to heal as well but not sanity again we're going low sanity That casket's still here from when Anthony was here. L quite some time ago when uh, Charlemagne walked the earth. Why is he looking up? Is there something up there? Who is it? Parga, Chachurga. <laughs> I know exactly what you mean. What are we looking at? I was like, what are we looking at, boys? Oh shit, they're false. The zombies were false, they were hallucination. The music's changing its mind. It's like, oh, I'm tripping. No, oh, it's good. No, oh, I'm tripping. Another diary page. Yeah. He realizes it was all a lie. We can't go down, can we? Or we should be able to find something here. Something I need. Push for maybe on that shelf over there. Yeah, there it is. The music sheet. You can hear the rain outside, that's wonderful. A, B, Y, X, B, Y, A. La. Oh, nice. Upgrading spells. Wait. How is that gonna help me, though? I'm still missing something. We need a third letter from Brother Andrew. Now I gotta repeat all of them with five so you know. Enter Bok Ma Magermore. Yeah, this is the part that's a little tedious, but you gotta do it if you wanna. Here's Chichurga for you, guys. Wait, I don't have Pargon. That's right. We don't have Pargon runes, so we can't really do it. Can't do anything until I have Pargon. That's the last rune, and then we can make all the all the spells right away. Oh, no, wait. We can't make seven point spells. So what am I missing here? I must be missing something. Up there, we only have those two rooms. And the bell tower down here we have that where could I be missing a gem am I missing a gem yeah I am missing a gem do I need a third page you know what I'll save and go check with oh no with uh, brother What's his face? Brother Bell Tower Man. I need a red gem. I forgot where that is. Maybe he gives it to me.
All right, rest up, Gramps. Oh, my head. All right. It's one of those now, huh? Proper response to hallucinating your head popping off of your body. That's probably how I would react too. Probably with like, ah, A little more convincing though. No, we need one more letter. Yep, I was right. Ah, it's easier to just go down there. Someone's banging on the door. How rude. So where could the green, the red thing be? Is it here? Red gem, red gem. Where could I be missing? Oh, fuck. I forgot one room. I know which room. The archbishop's room. That's right. Well, the old archbishop's room. From the days of Charlemagne. That's where I'll find, I'll find Anthony and the ruby. Man, he's slow. It's like he's going on a light jog, rescuing the world. And he's tired. Well, it's a realistic distance to get tired at, isn't it? Ah, oh, shit. Again? He's resting with his head off. <laughs> no? Losing limbs now as well? I mean my arm? Shit. I'm armless now. Oh, it can't get much worse than this. It's a little un unconvincing if you do it after you pop, man. <laughs> so uh, let's do an enchantment. Enchantment that always works. Is it more expensive? Let's try. Doesn't seem to be more expensive. Oh, but it won't hurt them. It'll just poison them, I think. There he is. Old Anthony. Still thinks he's protecting Charlemagne. He was just sitting there for hundreds of years. That's so fucked up. Can I finish him? Finally dead. No? Come on, Anthony. You're the good guy. Don't, don't fuck me over like this. I'm just trying to do what you did. Protect the tome. Had a flashback of his life, or at least like his final day. Yeah, only if, if only if he found the two-edged sword. If you find it with Anthony, that's the only way you'll get it with Paul. There was nothing here. What, were, what was he? What was Charlemagne doing with the Archbishop in here, anyway? Come on, we gotta save the world by jogging lightly with my three red balls flying around me. 
I'm going to save the world. I'm going to save the world. Yeah, yeah, baby. Wow, wow, wow. With my madness surrounding me in the face, I'm going to save the world from darkness, baby. With my family jewels, I'm saving the world. But I gotta save the game before I save the world. Die, little bastards. Baby zombies. Adult zombies. Kill them all. <laughs> Oh, I've been here before. I remember this place. I was here. Little sanity back, please. Is he coming back? Is he gonna hit me? I can't see, the camera angle's really against me. Down, boy. You you down? No, he's coming back up. It's the opposite of what I asked you to do. Okay. There's the statue from the house that follows you. <laughs> this is only one room, right? Yeah. Hi, zombie. Hello, zombie chow. Oh, shit, I'm a zombie. Look, you made me a zombie, zombie chow. I became a zombie. Well, I can join the undead legion, I guess. Into the darkness I go. Wait, why are you fighting me? I'm also a zombie. Oh, blah, 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 blah. Am I a zombie eating a zombie? Is that cannibalism? I'll eat your arm. Blah, blah. I'm going to explode, apparently. Wow, I've never seen that one. That's the first time I've seen that one. I think Zombie Chow gave it the boost. Kinda spoiled the next room for me, but what can you do? What do you mean? How come so? What, you don't like Eternal Darkness, zombie? Oh, crush his ribs. Fuck yeah. Dude. Oh, let's have him fight. We can bet on who's gonna win. Oh, I guess the green guy won. Alright, so red. Red, here I come. I got only six of these. I'll save them for now. Let's use the two-edged sword. Uh... Woo! Nice two-edged sword. Can't escape from it. Man, that was pretty good. That was pretty good. If I do say so myself. Just like that, the craziness is gone. No, just use it. Equip. There you go. That's the custodian statue. Gotta sacrifice him. So where did I come from? I came from there. That one's locked. There's no, nothing there. So we gotta go here. <clears throat> Burn.
All right, back to low sanity. I guess it's my destiny to be always be crazy. All right, they burn too. Good thing I'm coming across zombies that burn. God damn it, how long with the check? Because <laughs> I select the ammo first. Evil books, yada yada, but where's the... There's got to be... Arcane documents, that's right. I need another ladder. That'll open the door for me. Where is the third ladder? I guess just move along. I don't see a ladder here. Arcane, shit. There, I can save finally. Just push it. God. Okay, uh, red, green, green. Green. Let's go with the two edged sword. Damn, she's loud when ch chanting. Nice. Better than David <laughs> in narrow space with a knife. <laughs> How come? That makes no fucking sense, but here we are. You don't need arms. He's down. He's down, Luther. He's dead. Diary page on a pedestal. There's the third diary page. Blasphemous shrine. Blada yada yada, brutal realization, yada yada, essence of the unholy zealot that. Okay. So we got proof we need. Let's go back to our. Oh shit. That's the final rune. There you go. We can make better spells. Here we go. New spell. We gotta do all fives. Chaturga, protect. Self. And then Pargan Pargan. Then. Oh. Uh, doesn't matter what. Pargan Pargan. Then again. Absorb item. No. No, it's not absorb. It's uh, project. Project. Pargan Pargan. Item, project, then summon, no, summon creature, summon creature, bargain, bargain, oh shit, we made, a, we can summon zombies now, that's right, we can summon zombies, uh, what else is left for five, reveal invisible, Narakath Redgomor, Absorb area, okay. What else? Bancorok Red Gomor. I think I can do all the spells now, yeah, except for the final summon horror. We can summon Zombie Chow, yeah! What did I say? Narakath Red Gomor? Did I do that one? Absorb area? I think I did. No, damage field, shit. Bancorok Red Gomor. Protect area. Dispel magic. Netlek Red Gomor. Dispel area. Okay. Summon Trapper. Shield. Got it. I got them all. Okay. And the final one needs... Oh wait, there's more? So can we make them now? Like, let's say... Actually, three point. Project self? Nope. 
Protect self. I think we did that one, right? Protect area, protect self, protect enemy. Creature, protect. Yeah, there you go. Protect creature. Same with the five. This is the dull part, but after this, we'll have them all. There you go. Protect creature, what else could I do? Item project dispel dispel creatures absorb creature absorb area that's really invisible god damn it area creature self creature dispel protect area creature self I did Summon, maybe it absorb, project, project area. Yeah, there you go, project area. Eight, nine, so two are missing here, but we will, I think we'll, one of them will be summon horror and the other one what could the last one be? That was protect area, right? What else could be self? Oh, magic attack. Project. Did I have that? No, that's what I just did. Uh, that's magic attack. Shit, never mind, we'll find them. I got something new here. Alright. Pretty sure I'll find the uh, scrolls for the other spells. In just in case I was hasty, and I probably was. Because I'm playing this very loosely now. Check the corners, no spells. Yeah, they're gonna be like little paper things around. But there's still quite a few chapters to go through, so... We'll find them all. You you can make them earlier. That's what I like about this game a lot. You are free to make them earlier if you know how. You know, if you know which runes to use and you have the runes, the game's like, go for it. You're encouraged to, you know, experiment. Gotta get all the way back up to the Belfry. What a trek. We're still not done. Still gotta go <laughs> to the front of the church. Any enemies here? No? Okay. Wow, the camera angles backwards now come on you can do it you tired old man rest oh it just hit me so it's Paul Paul Luther here is voiced by Paul eating I said, I already mentioned Colonel Campbell's voice actor for Metal Gear Solid. Which makes sense because Silicon Knights were also working on the Metal Gear Solid remake for the GameCube. So they shared a lot of staff. What the fuck? <laughs> this isn't really happening! <laughs> No, it's not. No, it's not. You're, we're not on a computer. That—that's what gave it away first. 
It said remove the application and hard drive. I was like, what? While I'm crazy, I'm gonna talk to the man. Suspected Augustine all along. I managed to find remnants of his journal, and it all points to Augustine's. Raiden, can you hear me? Paganistic cult operating inside the cathedral. Aye, the cathedral's dark secret has been uncovered. I too suspected this, but was too afraid to act. Augustine himself is a heretic. He has covered his tracks well. Claiming that the sacred relic, the hand of Jude, was stored here. He had those who came to see it murdered. The hand of Jude never existed. The hand of Jude. And with that realization, the trap closes, brother. My days here are numbered. I awoke to find this cruel dagger placed upon my pillow this morn. It can only mean one thing. It's a puzzle item. I know too much. And they are moving to silence. Are, wait, he says he knows too much. You guys are supposed to be the smartest people of this era. Please, take this thing away from me. Its very sight troubles me to no end. May your faith protect thee, Brother Luther. Oh, that's all well, I have a crossbow and a cudgel. It's labeled a steel mace, you know. I have a steel mace and a crossbow and I got spells. Don't forget the spell. You, you just gave me a dagger. Shit, he didn't know shit. Goodbye, brother. Bell Tower boy. I forgot his name. Custodian. Brother Custodian. That's not his name. That's his... Occupation. But that's all he'll be known as. The Custodian. Oh, Mantorog zombie. That's enough of that, boy. You know what? I want some of the sanity you're gonna drop for me. Can't use it. Can we check it? Oh. Sacrificial knife. Just press up. I, I failed to press up for some reason. It's not much, but you know, it's more than nothing. Little sanity is better than no sanity. Uh, you know what? Screw you, guy. Here goes the rest of my sanity. I'm just gonna guess they're gonna be blue. So here we go. <gasps> Ooh, wait, 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 wait. I just got a spell upgrades, right? So enchant assign five green, red, green, blue, yeah. To Y. There you go. Five point. Also five point healing. It's about time, isn't it? Recover, assign five point red up. No, wait. Wrong one. There. And then this one up. There's some sanity. Restore. Or maybe just keep it three point. I don't... Nah. It's good. I rarely restore sanity for real here. So let's say like that. And then enchant... Five blue. There we go. Now we're... Playing with power. Zeltat's very loud when casting spell. Oh, I expected shit here. So much preparation for nothing. So what did I get? I got the knife. I gotta go down there and sacrifice my brother. Stab him in the chest. Damn, dude, you need to work out a little. Can't save the world with barely any stamina. Kind of zombies. Mentorov will work. Yeah. 
it would be smart to get some sta uh, sanity from them. They don't bring back much anyway. Look at that. Just a few pixels. Just so I don't lose health when, when I look at the first enemy. I'm gonna be crazy and say no to that. There's another one. I could leave this one. Just in case I want to come back later and... You know. Not now, Lupka. I'm trying to sneak here. Oh, shit. Alright. Because I want to keep him in case I want to come back and refill all my th shit. I can use him to go <laughs> to the trapper dimension. Have I saved recently? No, I have. I think what will make this game really challenging is having limited saves and limited, you know, saving locations. Because being able to save wherever, it's just... Well, not wherever. It won't let you save when there are enemies around or... When you've had a sanity effect close by, it also won't let you save. Jeez, blue, green, red, green, blue, yeah, all right, your time is up, evil guardian, uh, whatever you're called, little fucker, oh, Lupka, Lupka, we got, I, I just, before you came in, I read the Maximilian's autopsy entries for the, for the Uliot enemies, some of them are really unnerving, and, you know, they give uh, insight into the backstory. Basically, it sounds like it was an interview for the asylum. In the asylum where, you know, Maximilian was taken. Knife, right? Well, torch first and then knife. I think I just killed my friend. Five point, huh? We need five point dispel magic. It was blue, so green. Maybe be smart and like do that right away. And at this point, we could really cure, cure sanity. I don't think there's going to be any sanity effects here. Spell list, recover, five, green. That's not... Nearly as much as I thought it would be. Custodian. You are a clever man, Brother Luca. Wanting answers to clarify your new position as fugitive. You seek them out, and this is what you find. <laughs> Tell me, what does a man such as yourself think of when he finds a viper's nest of heresy? He finds the very source of corruption. I think of irony. There would be irony, wouldn't it? Irony of what you, masquerading as a member of the Inquisition, stand for. And that you stand for evil. Resident evil. Evil is evil. merely a perspective which no longer concerns me, Luther. You will be executed in the most painful manner imaginable after we have broken your frail body and mind in the name of our true lord it's like he recorded that line later our true lord Uliot. 
and let us return to our he, he wrote it on the back of his hand, like, who is my true lord again? Was it? I keep forgetting his name. Look like little cat skeletons, mm -hmm. demonic cat skeletons. <laughs> Your words have no power over here, mutation, for they do not ring true. Like that just failed assassination but by, by that guy over there. They missed their mark. <laughs> Bye guys. Wow, that was really crappy. That's the two guys he sent after me. He should know that I can enchant weapons and do shit, right? Like he's supposed to know that. There he goes. Horrible leader of darkness. Just like fucking horrible. You, you didn't even lock the door, did you? Man, no wonder they're gonna lose at the end. Like, they didn't really... Effort? Very low. Very low, I tell you. Could've... <laughs> Could've put more... I don't know... Put your cheeks into it, as that rude pigeon would say. Man bird. <laughs> you killed Zombie Chow. The only thing you man managed to do today, you gave Zombie Chow a stroke, and that's... That's a sin, Joe. That's that's really a sin. Here we go. Be gone, heresy. Ah, uh, heresy. <laughs> He's the living dead. So it's kind of... He's got the best of both worlds. Should better call the controller. Did you just break the floor? Your own floor, man. It should speak, though. This is the one that seeks to do combat. Mortal combat. Your task, my liege and greater guardian, is to guard this place. Do not worry about this world. This kind yelps in terror at the sight of your mightiness. We will dispose of him ourselves. How are you talking without lips, Pius? Can you please explain that? Oh, brutality. Man. I see fit. Be gone and leave me, and I will guard the artifact as you have instructed. Even Pius doesn't dare, you know, toe to toe with this guy. Yeah, that's that's my favorite Luther execution. Chaturga's messy, Zelatat's Zelatat like crazy, but Ulia just like. Monty Pythons him into the ground. A note from Edward. Edward, my late grandfather, what do you say? My dearest Alex, I'm glad that you have followed my paper trail thus far. I knew I can't do that voice for him. I knew I could... I knew I could depend on you. That's not what he sounded either. This will be the hardest part of your journey. Look for the 88 keys to continue your journey into the past. Your loving grandfather, Eduardo. Eduardo. All right, Gramps Eduardo, that was, that was quite enough, I will say. She is going crazy there. Below half sanity, so she's going to start tripping balls. <laughs> the, the fuck did I just read? <laughs> exactly, yeah. All right. We'll end it here for now. That was... Excellent, two very long chapters, and it wasn't rash. It wasn't like I didn't feel like I had to hurry, I just played it at my own pace, and 
that was very relaxing. I could have squeezed three chapters there, if, but w what's the point? You know, if, if you're not enjoying it, what's the point? Plus, this game is very Thank you. special with it. Uh, unscapable cutscenes. I think until you've seen all the versions of each cutscenes, you can't skip them or something like that. <laughs> Who's streaming right now? Let's see. Oh, Monster's doing RE3 Nemesis. Yeah. Yeah. Are you there? Twitch, it's me. Oh. It popped here before it popped here. <laughs> uh, every time I'm doing this, it's a new adventure with you, Twitch. Thanks for watching, everyone. Very happy to see you drop by. All of you there. Zombie, nice seeing you. It was short, but it was full of passion. <laughs> Mutation, thanks for hanging out. Lupka, go sleep. You need it. Nothing tomorrow. I'll see you. I'll see you on Saturday with uh, Zombies Revival and Mutations The Opposite Death Revival in Biohazard Outbreak. Till then, be well, everyone. Bye bye. Oh, yeah. I'll. We'll talk about it in Discord. It seems to be good now. Uh, for the most part, I have half the, the the bandwidth, but still not perfect. We'll see. We'll definitely test it before the stream, Zombie. But I, I believe it's going to be okay. I am here. I am streaming. So, yeah. Take care, everyone.